All right, guys, look at this. Look what we're doing. Look at what we're doing. Hardcore. DP. Oh. We last logged out. We got Blade of Cunning and the Jimba Jimbalaya. Okay. We got Balance Throwing Daggers. We got a Robe on. A Wine Stained Cloak. Like, we out here, dude. Let's take a look at the guild. Highest level. 38. 42 Chipamir. My man. I think we're about to head to uh to Westfall real soon here, boys. One of my favorite possible zones ever. Is Asmongold's video about cell phone being dead accurate or what? You know, it's it's really semantics. Is cell found the most poppin' wow ever? No. Is it Dead? Well, what, well, what do you? What does dead mean, right? It, it really comes down to well, what? What do you think dead means? Is there one person playing? Yes. Does that mean it's dead? Technically not, right? It's it's really just how facetious you want to be about the word dead. Hey, look, there's a player. It's not dead, right? But but yeah, I mean the reality is, is it the most pop and wow? No. And but 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 the but the point is, I don't think it was. That was ever the goal. Like it's supposed to be a more of a niche game mode, and I don't think there's anything wrong with that. So it's yeah, it's it's fun to just play in, in some downtime. All right, I'm gonna run the Goldshire and Fender everything. Right. Well met. Much Backstab, always, brother. kick, parry. Be careful. W. Backstab rank two, kick rank one. Oh, so it's just oh man, it's just all good. On every angle, this is fantastic. Challenge me to a duel to the death as a level 12 gnome mage. Absolutely not. No. Absolutely not. A normal duel? Okay, I'll do a normal duel. I just spared your life, cute girl. Oh my gosh. Like, yeah. Yeah. Guess we'll go get the pocket watch. I oh, actually so I need this pocket watch. Got it. I would kill Penny Blanco, but I've died to him before at this level. <laughs> I don't on a priest, if you guys remember. I don't wanna I don't wanna die to him. Help equals delete. I, I never asked for help. I never asked for help. I, I just stole the pocket watch and bounced. Like a true rogue? Yeah, guys, it's the Azar Assassin fantasy. I went in and got out without being noticed. Like what do you mean? I'm I'm role playing. What is that? Wait, how rare is that thing? He has a dagger. I can't kill it. He drops a huge dagger. I I. What, what do you want me to do? I could kite it into the town. He's a level 25. I haven't seen this in 20 years. I don't know if I've ever seen this. It's a blue dagger. I, I, I can't kill it, guys. I'm level 13. There's nothing I can do. Damn it. I really want to kill it. Be so big for me.
Oh my gosh. I really, I, I, but I can't. Like, what, what do you want? Like, hold on. I can use balanced throwing daggers to throw his life down to zero. But no, they're all just gonna miss. Guys, I can't kill it. I cannot kill it. I'm 13. I'm level 13. I can't do it, man. If there's a fence to kite it on, I could try. Voltros is the rarest mob in Westfall. I don't know if I've ever seen this one. Come back when you're older. Yeah, he'll be gone in a bit. There's this fence. I don't think that's big enough either. <sighs> the fact of the matter stands, I'm level 13 and that mob is level 26. Every throwing knife is just gonna dodge. I wonder how fast the mob runs. Oh my gosh, is... Oh, this level 14 just aggroed it. Oh, the level 14 probably had no idea. <laughs> That's funny. It's slow. Okay, it is slow. It is really slow. You're right. Let's go for it. Dude! Bro! Feathered cape, sad face. Bruh. Well, it didn't drop the dagger anyway, so I guess we're fine. <laughs> Level 60 feels amazing in hardcore. Not that many people on at your time. Every endgame zone, you always see at least 160 and usually group up with them to get quest done. And I truly love it. Yeah, yeah. What I, what I like, um, what I liked about uh, the add-on days where there wasn't many 60s. And since there wasn't many 60s, when you saw a 60, it was kind of cool. It was rare. It was like, wow, man. You did it. You know? I, I think this is an unpopular opinion again. But, and, and I said this since day one, and I still stand by it. I think hardcore would have been more fun if they did self found on launch for everyone. Like way less people would be 60, way more people would have died. And I think the content would have been way, way better for longer because it wouldn't have been solved so fast and people wouldn't have swiped and got to level 60 and then quit. It would have been more of a, a challenging journey. I, I'm surprised so many people are agreeing with me. I'm, I'm gonna be honest, cause it's, it's, I think it's an unpopular opinion. Everyone being on self found also means there's no profession. Like there's a lot of negatives. There are negatives, right? Like there's there's no um, You can't level professions as easy. You can't trade till 60. The auction house is dead. The MMO aspect of a lot of it's ruined Right like there's there there's negatives like I'm gonna be honest, but I think the negatives are worth it, you know Okay, okay, okay So the harvester robe is a robe. Okay, I'm gonna be right back guys. I'm gonna uh, go to the restroom I will be right back. BRP. I'll uh, me AFK in a really cool spot. Yeah, right here, baby, right there. All right. All right. Really, guys. When I'm AFK, we're really doing this on the family-friendly stream. We're not just gonna chill out and have have a unbelievable. Okay, I came for a family-friendly stream and there were strippers, dude. That was not me. I was AFK. I was making a protein shake for some massive gains. We are going to the restroom, filling up some water. All right. Kai had a uh, pe pediatric appointment today, the, so I was talking to Shannon, getting caught up on how that went, which everything seemed to go pretty well, so very grateful for that. And, uh, yeah.
Forgiveness is important. We're not gonna. Okay, we're not gonna. We're not gonna kick him. No. Okay. Okay. Forgiveness. 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 It's fine. Oh, bro. When backstab crits, it's just. It's so nice. I want. I, I'm gonna rush improved ambush, boys. Like I. I want to rush improved ambush. I want to. I want to get 18 for ambush, and then when I'm level like 23, I'm gonna have improved ambush. Bro, what is this mage doing? Oh, dude, dude, you're gonna, bro, move, move it, move it. Run. No, 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 Millen. Is that the guy plugging Peo's Twitch Prime? Was that the one plugging Peo's Twitch Prime? Okay, maybe that guy deserved it, okay. <clears throat> Can I kill this Campanoles chat? I feel like if I kite one out, no. I feel like if I kite one out and just kill one and then reset, I probably could. No way. Oh, it's four. I thought only two aggroed or three. I'm not killing four gnolls. There's no way I'm killing four. You can do it? Dude, there's no shot. What if I... I can't split pull all of them because they don't... If you face pull the leash... Nope. Not true. Sap one and the 1v3 them. Dude, a 1v3 is still not a great situation to be in. Pull from the left and then drag left. I think they all, all four pull no matter what. I think they all four pull. Oh, only three pulled. Okay, can we do three chat? Let's try it. Evasion. Evasion, explosive rocket. One down. Bro, he's stealing my glory. Oh my, I had it. That guy stole my glory. Guys, I, I had it, right? Everyone, everyone agrees I had that. Right? We all agree? You probably had the one before anyway. Eh, I, I don't know if I had four. I mean, I sold a pot. Maybe I could have done four. Delete, because I got helped. Dude. There's three here, but I don't have evasion. I don't know if I can take on three without evasion, to be honest. But let's find out. Gouge is insane. All right, we got it. Everybody relax. We got it. We got it. We got it. We got it. Bro, gouges. Like the things you can do with gouge. Spacing and movement and kiting. That's what we're talking about. Till it misses. Yeah, but then you could just gouge again. It's only on a 10 second cooldown, you know? Mm, I don't know if I can kill these. This one's a 13. 13 is a little sketchy. Bro, this null pot quest is always so annoying because you have to kill the camps. I have evasion in 36 seconds. Oh, 
Oh, we got a range null. Okay, that range null is kind of owning me, but... Dodge! Oh my gosh! I can potion, I guess. Yeah, it's a potion. Damn it, I didn't want a potion. Bro, what if Gouge just dodges? It's terrible. Okay. That's three. All right, we're limit testing here, boys. We're limit testing. Are up to officer. If there was any other office, like we we probably want more officers. I mean, Hodes are an officer. I'm trying to think who else can make an officer. Hi, yeah, bro. I'm gonna be living on the ambush crits real soon, man. I can't wait for ambush. My whole character is based on ambush. We need a good dagger and ambush crits, and we are going to be farming, dude. Is this guy self found? Pff, not even self found. You got this. I believe. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. And summoner against three nulls here, casting the immolate. Big damage coming out. Two of them have dots on them. One null goes down as a summoner versus two other nulls, and a third null just spawned next to him. Summoner starts to run. He goes for the fear being casted. Uh, this is really close here. Summoner, nice, gets the full fear, kills one null, down to 30% life with a big bandage, securing himself a. Great position here in the 1v1 versus the final null. Fear never breaks. Warlocks are broken OP, but the fear does come to an end. Immolates being casted. Big dots coming through, and there is a one. Captain Dwarf goes down in our guild at level 17. And Summoner does manage to pull off the 1v4 in the clutch against the nulls. Wow. Wait, was Captain Dwarf the role player? Iron Fist? Oh, he was. That was the role player. You guys are right. Stone Fist, yeah, Stone Fist. Dun da da. Okay, let's go turn this Westfall stew in. Head down to the Sentinel Hill, and then we could try to kill some pillies. <laughs> this guy's name is Captain America. <laughs> He's just punching, dude. <laughs> Steve Rogers was a Stormwind soldier with an indomitable spirit. Born in Old Town, he has always had an unwavering sense of justice and righteousness. He longed to defend the innocent and uphold the values of honor and courage through his strength, though his strength would often fail him. Through his courage, Steve was selected for a top secret SI7 mission. Headed by the enigmatic Dr. Joan Schmidt, a master alchemist, Dr. Schmidt in his quest for power developed a mysterious elixir known as the Super Soldier Serum. Recognizing Steve's unwavering resolve and pure heart, Schmidt offered him a chance to become more than just a soldier. He offered him the opportunity to become a beacon for all. With pure determination, Steve accepted the serum, transforming into Captain America, a symbol of strength, bravery, unwavering determination for all in Azeroth. Empowered by the serum, he embarked on a quest to vanquish an evil, protect the innocent, and champion the values of justice and freedom throughout the lands. With shield in hand and a heart filled with righteousness, Captain America vowed to stand as a beacon of hope, inspiring all who cross his path to strive for a better tomorrow. Slash bow, slash respect, slash salute, slash kneel, slash duel. Well met, Steve. 
I love how there's so many people on hardcore that are doing like role playing characters now. Oh, level 11 just went down. Okay, look at the add on it. Read. What? Bro, everyone knows rogues get the opener. Oh no. Oh, this is all bad. There's no way we're gonna pot in a duel. Oh my. Oh, <gasps> bro, he freaking uses the. Sixty hunter just died. Sixty hunter just died in Western Plaguelands. Tell Mama I love her. He says, before dying. Okay, we're gonna get a crit because he's sitting. Woo wee! You're gonna try to fake kick the Czar Assassin? It's not happening. I just, I was like getting really proud of myself that I just, I won the duel. And then I started thinking, and uh, this guy actually has no main hand at all. He's uh, he's punching me, and I still almost lost, so... Can't be too excited. Slash... Neil. Assassination contract. Rare spawn, Sergeant Brash. Claw must die. Last scene, 35-34. On my way. <laughs> On my way. Con assassination contract, boys, we're in. 3534. Let's go assassinate him. Actually, let me turn this quest in real quick because it's right here. And then let's go assassinate him. <laughs> this guy goes, good luck, agent. If you're captured, SI7 will disavow any involvement. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Wait, my contract is to kill this level 18 elite? No, shot. I can't kill a level 18, dude. Bro, there's no way this guy just dies, right? This this level 20 is not going to just die, right? Holy crap, this level 20 almost just died trying to kill him. Bro, someone give me a contract to kill Sergeant Brashclaw, level 18, rare. Bro, I can't. Dude, I love the idea of contracts, but you can't just have me kill an 18, dude. That doesn't make any sense. Oh man, I wish I could get a mask. Yo, chat, where do I get one of these masks? It's, it's from like Dead Mines, right? Or can I get them from the trappers? Just farm to Fias? Oh, maybe I can get him from these tr these these guys. Contract declined. <laughs> yeah, there's no way we're we can kill level 18. I would love to try to kill that, but I would need a lot more time, right? Okay, let's kill some uh, let's kill some of these guys, some looters and pillagers. This is definitely no easy quest. This is where I died on my very first hardcore tune ever. I've said this once, I'll say it again. Hardcore is way more fun when there's less people playing. The fact of the matter is, if there was 500 people here, like on Hardcore Launch, all of these mobs are permanently dead and it's not scary anymore. It's not scary when there's 500 people spawn, spawn camping these guys. It becomes way more scary when they're all up and you have to figure out how to take them down. You know what I mean? Except there's no one for dungeons. Yeah, right now there's too little. Like, let me be clear too. Yeah, there's there's too little people right now for sure. But there's 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 way, there's way too many people on launch where it wasn't even scary, right? It wasn't even scary. But yeah, no, I agree. Obviously, you want enough people playing to where it's fun too. Is it possible to fill a dead mines group at this point? Dead mines, I'm sure you could do. Like, look how many people are even even just in our guild at that level range. You could probably fill a dead mines for sure. Yeah. But 
you start getting like higher level, it's probably gonna get real tough. Oh crap. I never got my sap. Uh oh. Okay, that's a potion. I had to pot. No pot, no bandage. I have a vage if I really want, but. Okay, we got it. Okay, yep, little too close for comfort there. Little too close for comfort there. We'll take it. Little spooky, yeah. Nine out of 15 on the pillagers and 15 out of 50 on the looters. Okay, six more pillies, boys. And I still don't have the mask. Yo, IJ, Cobbsy, Cobbsy, thanks for the prime. AOP, thanks for the T1. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. I didn't know I aggroed the pillager. Oh crap, okay. This might be really dumb. Alright, we got him. And I'm gonna go remorseless just because I, I think it seems I think it seems okay. Is why. Bro, I, I there's like no more quests to do here. I don't know what's going on with that. There's a plus four stamina rogue in lock mode on too. Oh you're right, robe of the keeper. You know, I probably should go get the plus four stamina robe. And it looks cool too, right? It kinda looks cool. Yeah, let's go to lock mode on. Let's go to Lock Modon, boys. Lock Modon bound. Go, 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 go. Everybody prime. We're gonna do this elite quest here. It's all it's a level 12 elite quest. Oh, they give us a two stamina leather chest that we can't even use. Dude, unironically, this leather chest has more roleplay value than mine. Like, look how assassin-y I look with this thing. But the challenge is is very clear. Robes only, right? So I can't use it. All right, the vagash. This guy invites me to a group. I can't, I'm self found. I'm solo, I can't. Oh crap. I could offense kite this guy, but since I'm a level 15 with evasion up and a Giga Chad, we're just gonna kill him. Claw. Okay. Yeah, I, I can't. I can't join groups. I can't join groups. Doing a solo run. Sorry, brother. Or sister. It's an idol. All right, let's go get that uh that robe, huh? Four stamina robe of the keeper. Four stamina cloth robe for this challenge. Boom. I'm an assassin. That's, it's actually fat. It's actually super insanely fat. Yeah, that's massive. I got the craftsman dagger and the robe of the keeper. Bro, my gear is actually low key kind of cracked. I have the cloak of the people's militia. I have the robe of the keeper and the hunting pants and two green tags. Like this, this goes kind of dumb hard. All right, boys, I think that's where the uh, the journey will indeed end for today. So Assassin 2, we made it to level 16. We got Robe of the Keeper. We got another green dagger, green pants. We're not dead yet. The next stream or two are going to be uh, dead mines and then Wailing Caverns. It's going to be a good time, boys. If you enjoyed the stream, make sure to hit the follow button. Don't forget to Twitch Prime to your favorite streamer once a month. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow we have No Morgan again because it's Friday. Reacts into No Morgan, into STV, into Ashenvale, into Solo Self Found.